I can't be neutral about what I saw in Denver this weekend, where an African-American police officer was on his chopper, I just like to use the terminology, it's a motorcycle where I'm from, from Brentwood, Los Angeles, it's horrible. And he was pushed over by an Occupy Wall Street thug. He was just on his police motorcycle and he was pushed over. And an Occupy Wall Street guy standing in his proximity with a bullhorn started to call the African American motorcycle officer who got up quickly and sprinted and tackled the perpetrator. He called him a fascist and a pig. What's wrong with this picture? <laughs> Why isn't this on ABC, CBS, NBC, and CNN? I watched a week after the health care bill was passed how the mainstream media lied about the N-word thing. They made it up. They said it's the most serious thing that's ever happened in the history of the world that Congressman Carson Lewis were attacked with the N-word, and we showed not only the $100,000 proof that it didn't happen, but when the Associated Press said the absence of video doesn't mean it didn't happen, uh, I said, okay, then I'll find you four videos from the exact place and time, and they walked down unobstructed. No mob ever surrounded them. They lied through their teeth. Yet, not only did the mainstream media turn, turn it into the biggest story of uh, the week, they resurrected it six months later when the NAACP, a politicized organization, decided to issue a uh, basically a, a, a one-sided attack on the Tea Party that the mainstream media allowed for Benjamin Jealous to go, ABC, CBS, NBC, CNN, New York Times, we condemn the Tea Party for racist elements within and use that fake thing as the centerpiece. 